Coach, first I've got to ask, how do you feel about Zion choosing Duke over Clemson, the hometown spot? Well, look, I'm so proud of Zion, and it was his decision. Um, it would have been nice for him to stay in state, either Clemson or South Carolina. But I told him uh, he's the one that's going to actually have to go to class. He's the one going to have to get up at you know, 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning and, and do conditioning and lift weights and then go to class and that sort of thing. So he needed to do – he needed to go – to a place where he wanted to uh, to go because it, it was his decision. Right, right. Now, on the court, we've seen the talent this kid has, but what are some of the things you've gotten to know about him as a person that have helped lead to his success? Well, Zion is probably one of the most humble uh, individuals uh, I've ever coached. He cares a lot about uh, the program, the team, his teammates. I think he, he puts uh, everyone in front of himself, and that's kind of unusual for a 17-year-old kid uh, to put others before, before himself. A 17-year-old kid, too, with a very high profile. What has it been like for you coaching arguably the most famous high school player since LeBron James? I tell people all the time uh, he does stuff that I've never seen anybody do, and when when he does something in the game, uh, I'm sometimes I'm amazed, but then I'm not because I see him do amazing stuff every day in practice. Uh, so it's been it's been a thrill being able to coach him. I, I can tell you this: my plays work a whole lot better when he's involved. <laughs> and speaking of some of that amazing stuff you've seen him do, he's he's known for a lot of his dunks. But what is the most underrated part or more, most underrated valuable part of his game? What, what Zion is, his skill set is so amazing. A lot of people do focus in on the dunk. But besides dunking, his skill set is so amazing. He can handle the ball. Uh, his IQ is, is so high. He likes to get his uh, teammates involved. He, he's, he's a willing passer. Um, he's just an all-around player. Great rebounder, a great defender well-rounded game obviously very well-rounded player but what's one area of his game that you think he needs to develop to maintain this level of success in the college game well I certainly think that Zion is the type of person that he's going to continue to work hard on things that he needs to get better at uh, he's always in the gym uh, working on uh, his weaknesses to make them into strength uh, he's always working on his ball handling. He's he's working on his outside shot. He's the type of player that's going to make himself into the best player possible. But he's not content. He wants to be better.